my name is Jessica, and I will be taking you on this journey into history. I have always been fascinated with history, mysteries, and the paranormal, so I decided to create a podcast that encompasses all those things. If you find these things fascinating, like me, then please, I encourage you to come along each week to see where history takes us next. Hey, this is Jessica from Ancient Secrets and Haunted Journeys. The month of October is going to be a little different. Uh, Every day I am going to visit a different haunted location. So please be sure to come back and see where we go next. Welcome back to another episode of Ancient Secrets and Haunted Journeys. We're on a global haunting tour this October. And today we're heading to a place that even the government warns you not to visit after sunset. I'm talking about the infamous Bangar Fort in Rajasthan, India. So light some incense, sit back, and prepare for a journey into the mysterious and the macabre. Located in the Alwar district of Rajasthan, Bangar Fort is a 17th century fortification surrounded by ruins, temples, and a small village. At first glance, it might seem like any other historical site, but Bangar has a reputation that sets it apart. It's considered one of the most haunted places in India. And local legends offer some chilling explanations for the paranormal activity reported there. The fort was built in 1631 by Bhagwant Das for his younger son, Madho Singh. The area was a thriving community with markets, palaces, and temples. However, it's said that the fort and its surroundings fell into ruin due to a curse. There are two popular legends explaining this curse. The first involves a holy man, or sadhu, named Baba Balanath, who agreed to the fort's construction on the condition that it never cast a shadow over his dwelling. However, as the fort expanded, this condition was broken, invoking his wrath and cursing the area. The second legend is more romantic, but equally tragic. It involves a beautiful princess named Ratnavati and a sorcerer who fell in love with her. When she rejected him, he tried to use a love potion on her, but she discovered his plan and thwarted it, causing a boulder to crush him. Before dying, he cursed the princess, her family, and the entire village. Whether due to a curse or simply the passage of time, Bangar Fort was eventually abandoned, and that's when the reports of hauntings began. Visitors and locals have reported hearing footsteps, screams, and eerie music. Some have even claimed to see apparitions and shadow figures. The most chilling part? The Archaeological Survey of India manages the site and has a sign warning visitors not to enter the fort after sunset or before sunrise. Paranormal investigators and thrill-seekers have been drawn to Bangar, and many have left with unsettling experiences. Some have reported feeling watched or followed, while others have captured unexplained phenomena on camera. The fort has been the subject of numerous documentaries and TV shows, each adding to its eerie reputation. Skeptics often attribute the reports of hauntings to local folklore and the power of suggestion. However, the consistency of reports and the sheer volume of experiences make it hard to dismiss Bangar as a product of overactive imaginations. Some theories suggest that the fort is a hot spot for paranormal activity due to the curses that plague it. Others believe that the intense suffering and death that may have occurred here have left a residual energy that manifests as hauntings. Whether you're a believer or a skeptic, the story of Bangar Fort serves as a chilling reminder that some places carry a weight of history and mystery that can't easily be explained. If you ever find yourself in Rajasthan, visiting Bangor Fort might offer you a glimpse into the unknown, and perhaps an encounter with the spirits that still linger there. That's all for today's episode. As we journeyed into the haunted depths of Bangor Fort, join us tomorrow as we explore another location that will make your hair stand on end. Until then, keep your minds open and your spirits guarded.